Tinubu met uh, Buhari in London. And Buhari is saying that he doesn't want to be involved in any proof. Why would you not be involved in any proof after scattering the country? You see, say, na dem dem. So all of you who are thinking that a... Uh, who are calling Tinubu to come and prove Buhari and his men. There are some people that are going to prove, not all Buhari's uh, uh, cronies. And the ones they say they are even probing, it will not go no, nowhere. These guys, you see all these old people, not they, even they involved in stealing. You see them? What good can these people tell us? And nonsense, uh, Mokri telling us that uh, Tinubu is uh, courageous like uh, Awolo. Tinubu, as a short, is a... Uh, predecessor Muhammad Bari that he and his close is will be spared in any anti-corruption war his government engages in so our reporters can report <laughs> oh, and all of you be calling this and this and that and that's why they are changing the narrative that if a, 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 a fellow was the president in this country on on top of a fellow now they won't put everything every the nonsense thing that APC has done. They are putting it on, on, on top of uh, Emifele's head. Sahara reporters learned on Tuesday that uh, this was discussed during the meeting between Tinubu and Buhari in London, United Kingdom, on Monday night. The president's assurance to his predecessor comes amid repeated and ongoing move by the Secret Police Department of State Services to place a lead on further investigation of politically exposed persons by the anti-corruption body, economic, the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission. Even if there's anybody that wants to fight corruption, he'll be even, he'll not even fit here. Tinubu cannot fight corruption. You know the kind, you know these antecedents, and that won't fight corruption. Already, the DSS has carried out raids on EFCC offices in Lagos and Abuja, cutting away sensitive files, documents, and flash drives on investigations into alleged fraudulent activities of former Governor, senators, and ministers, Sahar reporters earlier reported. Sahar reporters earlier reported that Tinubu returned to Nigeria on Tuesday ahead of a Idi Kaba celebrations after spending a week in Europe. The president departed Nigeria on June 20th to participate in the two day new global financial pact summit held in Paris, France. Tinubu, who was initially scheduled to back. To be back in Abuja on Saturday, proceeded to London, United Kingdom for a short private visit. On Monday night, Tinubu met with former President Buhari. However, sources to Sahara reporters that say part of what formed the subject of their discussion was an agreement that Buhari and his close is would not be bothered by any proof or any anti-corruption war during Tinubu's tenure. Tinubu met Buhari to reportedly discuss that Buhari and his close aide will not be bothered by the, any corruption war. He saw to Sahara reporters. <laughs> she would have, would have done see, of course, we don't see all this uh, shenanigans. Say, if anybody, we've said it, if there's anybody expecting these people to prove them, uh, you'll be, you, you'll be, you, you are dreaming. You just have to wake up from your, from your dream. How much did obedience give this writer to do this job? <laughs> writer, Sahara reporters, you must be, you must be on serious, you must still drag others to your calamities. Can you imagine? They are telling you, is it a, a Sahara reporters that is not a obedient a media? <laughs> you see then, shame, go soon catch on a fuel is still under 15 and electricity be increased to 40% from July 1st. Federal government 1,000 are compulsory levy for cars owners monthly. Hey, it's getting tight gradually. Soon, she will not even let you come out. The old Nigeria is waiting and watching the magic Jagaban did in Lagos to happen in Nigeria. He just returned from France medical treatment and he will travel again before one month. Suddenly, you chameleons are not talking again. Tinubu and his government have increased all the salaries of senators, house of reps, but nothing have been done to make things better for the low class citizens. Buhari will even laugh at last. Wait for his. This thing is suffering from generation madness. Who told you that it was their write up? Won't you let them rest for a while? No matter. Say now be the write up. <laughs> that is the country we live in. Funny set of people. If you don't probe them, 
God will do someday. Oh, Lenny, when you were stealing and cutting away the nation's treasury, you never knew that you would be probed. Don't even worry, we will soon extradite you from the UK, Baba Barawo. So Jubri, Mr. Integrity, knew his ally, Mick Nigeria, and he was fighting corruption. <laughs> you will be disturbed, Mr. Buhari, because you inflicted too much pain on Nigerians. You are the worst president Nigeria has ever elected. You are a bad market. I pity those that cast their vote for you to be president of Nigeria. So Buhari and his co-travelers have finally cashed out those billion dollars. Now so you've been and I they expect in Umbu. All of see, don't mind them, all those ones who are in Lagos who are supposed to Nubu, they are hypocrites too. Tinubu they press their neck for God knows how many decades. Now just last year because of tribalism, all of the just got the support. And within them, they don't say the things are not working for them. Things were not working for them. So is it now that it will not work for them? One that shall never end in Nigeria. But common Nigerians who stole one or two things are being jailed every now and then. So Buari doesn't even want to be proved because he rigged election for APC. But why is the, SA, the SSS interfering with the work of ESCC? Any okay if it is a matter of time anyways it's a matter of time nigeria only exists in the minds of fools in the minds of fools you can see that one say me don't disturb me for any problem that one say, don't worry you and your you and your men are exempted we said it now are <laughs> you just knowing that's what now it's unfortunate so guys let's say your opinion and have your take on this